Hey YouTube, this is Miss Wilson coming to you with another tutorial. Uh, I should say organic tutorial. I just received my package in the mail uh, last night. And um, yes, the toy. Now, my subscribers, you guys know I got a little girl that's, you know, every time I try to make a video, here she come. Or, you know, I'm working on something and she's just like all in the mix. So I keep something on my station that I can uh, distract her with or compromise or uh, negotiate basically um, to kind of distract her so mommy can finish what I'm doing but without further ado let's get started she's taking her nap thank God uh, so I'm going to try to make this video as quick as, pos as quick as possible oh Lord I can't speak forgive me um, that way there's no interruptions, you know, babies in the background, you know, tripping or nothing like that. So, yes, let's get started. First, I'm going to start with these. I finally got my forms. Now, those of you that are thinking about switching to organic, because that's what I'm doing, is trying to switch, you know, to organic because they're a great product. They're, you know, a great company. Um, these forms are $15.00. $15 and you get 500 for $15 yeah see formas those forms rollo roll and then the C represents count and you get 500 um, I watch a lot of the organic videos and um, like I love them like I love I can't understand nothing they talking about uh, but I watch it like I do. Like, I do. And my boyfriend's like, why are you always watching the little Mexican channel? And I'm like, it's not a Mexican channel. I'm like, well, I wish they did have some tutorials uh, in English and Spanish. Because I feel like, you know, they should branch out um, to other nationalities and stuff like that. Because, I mean, as being a corporation, if, if I was in charge or CEO... I wish, you know, I would love to make that CEO money. But if I was CEO of a nail, you know, company or a corporation, I would do it in Chinese, Japanese, uh, all the other niece, uh, African. I speak that. I really would. Like, I would try to do some Spanish, a little bit of everything because I would want to be diverse. I would want everybody to to purchase you know and love my product and stuff like that and I'm not saying that they're not like that um, but I'm just saying like come on organic make some tutorials so I can understand what you're talking about like I don't have people that can translate for me the whole video I'm just saying you know don't get mad I'm not trying to disrespect nobody or nothing like that I'm just saying I would like to watch their tutorials in English too that's all that's it I love their products but some of this stuff I have to ask the people or ask like a girlfriend like hey what does this mean and, you know what is this for and she'll break it down to me and that's cool I appreciate that I love her uh, but I just wish they did stuff in English so that everybody can understand not just um, the Hispanics or uh, Latinos or whatever that's it that's all so I got that let's see I got me another brush. I got me Organics Nail Pro 8 Acrylic Wood. Um, I got the 6 already, but I wanted to try the number 8. And um, it's a little bigger, which I like that. Like, the number 6 is really not that small, but it's small. And, um, yeah. I would use that for like a feel, depending on what size of the nail bed, you know, the client was. But I use it for like 3D stuff and I use it for everything. The number six. So I wanted to try number eight. Now this was twenty twenty four dollars. The aluminum one is thirty two. I wanted to try the aluminum one, but at the same time I didn't want to pay thirty two dollars when this brush will do the same thing. The aluminum ones just look a little bit more slimmer and longer to me. But, you know, if I'm wrong, you know, you guys are more than willing to correct me. Leave your comments at the bottom. Um, you know, I don't mind having a conversation with anybody. I really don't care. Um, my brush came a little loose right here at the barrel. 
So what I did, I took some glue, some good glue, and um, I put the glue right here and I tilted it down so that the glue can run, you know, inside of the barrel. And um, I kind of like forced it, well not forced it, and it just ended up sticking. And it doesn't move anymore, it's not wobbly or anything like that. So, you know, I um, pretty much fixed the problem. And it, it kind of like made me realize when you buy from a company that says, you know, no refunds or returns, you expect your stuff to come brand new, no problems, nothing. And my first brush didn't even, you know, have this problem, wasn't wobbly at the barrel or nothing. This one was. And I feel like as people that do this for a hobby or it's our profession or anything like that if we order from a pro if we order from a company and we have to pay eight dollars or whatever six dollars or something for shipping our products or our items should come as we think they should come brand new no problems nothing but I fixed it like I said I'm not trying to complain or nothing like that but I'm just saying like they should have it to where you might not be able to get your money back, but they will exchange it for either another brush or whatever else you might want to subsidize it for. That's all I'm saying. But if y'all think I'm tripping, then, you know, leave your comments below and uh, we can talk about it. We can talk about it. All right. So push that to the side. I got Organic Nails Shaper. Now, I watched a tutorial on here and a lady was doing her brushes now it seemed kind of thick when she had poured it into her little dampen dish and she shaped her brush and she told me how she takes care of all her brushes and you know brushes that she's had for years um and this is four dollars and you can get 30 milliliters and um i bought it mainly because i have all these babies right here all of them. I got my 3D brushes, my cleanup brushes, um, that silver one back there. I had that since school. Uh, yeah, and I got my big one. It's kind of uh, flat. That's a 20. And yeah, I have a lot of brushes. And I want to be able to take care of them because it's just like how I do my makeup brushes. I wash them. I got my little spa glove from Sigma. And I wash them. And I lay them tilt down like this with the head this way. And that way the water doesn't run, you know, towards the barrel and loosen up the glue or anything like that. So, you know, I got to take care of my babies too. So I got this. And then I got these. Now, I already have one of those, and this is the glue that I was telling you that I had, the split second glue. Now, when I tell you this glue works like no other, I love this too, the protein bond. Oh yes, works wonders. But that glue, the split second glue, its name fits it because... When I did my last client, I did a corkscrew and uh, everything. She was going out on a date Saturday night, like last week. And I used this glue. I didn't have to wait that long. I didn't have to fan it. I didn't have to, like, blow, even though you're not supposed to do that anyway. Because in school, it's like, you know, bacteria, germs, all that stuff. Like, you don't want to blow on, the, on your client's nail. Um, I would try everything. And I would buy ASP glue. IBD glue, the brush on glue for like five something at Sally's. Um, and they weren't they weren't working and they did that to three clients. So I got really frustrated when it came to glue. And then my first organic haul, I had bought the split second nail glue. I'm so in love. I had to buy two more. Now these two are gonna go in my storage um little box that I have sitting behind me. Um, because I already have one open and it makes no sense to have all three of them open. No, I'm going to save those so I don't have to worry about purchasing glue, you know, for a little while. Um, yeah, like I really recommend this glue. Um, and if you guys are having similar problems with glue and can't really find a good one, then, you know, go to plantamo.com or the organic website and 
just they're a dollar fifty a piece. And the uh, the bigger one, I think it's seven grams or five grams, it's three dollars for the brush on glue. It it can't like you can't go wrong. You really cannot you cannot go wrong with this glue. It really works. I love it. Um the next time I do another organic order I probably just order the brush on glue just to try it but glue is glue it doesn't matter if it's in this bottle or the brush on bottle it does not matter to me uh hmm let me see oh and I don't know how many other of you um youtubers might feel like this but I love organic videos I always watch them you know, especially before I go to bed or whatever, because I like to see, you know, what designs and, you know, just stuff like that. Um, my issue is, or what I would like to see them make English tutorials. I'm so serious. Like, I don't get frustrated. I just be like, damn. Like, if they can make an English or English tutorials and Hispanic tutorials or you know Spanish tutorials like if I was a CEO of a company which I wish because I would love to have that CEO money um, I would want to branch out to everybody not keep it in one category or anything like that now I'm not saying you know take it away from the Mexicans no that's not what I'm saying I would just if I was CEO of a company or a corporation I would branch out to the Chinese, the Japanese, uh, any of the nieces, uh, Africans. I would speak that, whatever they be speaking. Um, I would. Like, I would do everybody, not just one nationality. Like, I would want my stuff to be bought by everybody. Just everybody's salon you know what I mean I would like you know but I would really like to see English tutorials I, I can't always have somebody translate a tutorial for me you know what I mean because who does that I watch them anyway and my boyfriend's like why do you always watch that you know you don't even understand what they're talking about I'll be like I don't have to understand I just watch it you know I just try to piece it together you know what I mean um stuff like that but really YouTube I would really like to see them convert to different um, nationalities black, white, blue, purple, alien uh, black and these, whatever like I would like them really to just come out of that box and you know allow everybody to enjoy um, what they're doing within their own uh, you know nationality or within their own race I love me some Mexicans. I love burritos and tacos and corn and starter burritos and, you know, uh, mole and, oh my gosh, menudo. Everybody can't cook menudo, but my friend mom, she hooks it up. And every time she makes it, I'm right at her dinner table talking about, uh, can I get some more? Like, yes. So, I done babbled on about everything that I can think of. But uh, thank you, ladies and gents, for watching. Um, I look forward to making more tutorials for you. Uh, I have more Halloween nail art to show, so that's another tutorial. But I appreciate all the love. Um, all the new subscribers, thank you so much for showing me some love. I will return the favors or, you know, the love. But... Like I said, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys have a nice, safe Halloween just in case, you know, I don't make another tutorial for a while. Um, yeah, you guys have a good day.